hope you guys uh, doing well and today i'm going to show you that how you can set up grunt with node.js so i have opened a side uh, uh, node.js and uh, uh, i'm going to install the recommended uh, for most user person uh, so you can also download it and save this into your computer and once um, it will uh, download you can install it and uh, once this will download I, I can continue my video again here we downloaded the uh, node.js and now I'm gonna install it in my computer so you can also see the results I have already installed this that's why uh, I'm getting this message so uh, once you can install it and finish it um, you have to go to uh, terminal and uh, open folder here is my example uh, there I can install my grant so I'm gonna select this one and uh, now I'm gonna click here and then go to terminal so now I'm gonna write here npm install grunt grunt cli and uh, globally So once we install this, uh, we need to uh, create a Node.js file here uh, with the uh, uh, grunt file .js. So here we can configure the uh, plugins whatever you want to install here uh, I'm just uh, yeah, this is uh, just an introduction uh, video you uh, I'm gonna uh, configure this node.js file uh, look here uh, I have uh, installed the uh, uh, globally and here we got the file node modules and grunt file and grunt uh, cmd so here we have created the grunt file.js so I'm gonna add some modules here so I'm gonna write here some code module dot exports is equal to function and then grant yeah here we got the function and uh, now I'm gonna uh, configure my grunt so grunt in in it config and then this is this is here we uh, can call any plugin uh, that uh, uh, we may find uh, in our uh, grunt uh, plugin directory you can also find any any of uh, uh, the plugin and select whatever you uh, want to implement in your uh, grunt setup so uh, in this video I'm gonna uh, use the uh, command uh, grunt in it so <coughs> Here we get. Uh, here we uh, uh, getting started. Um, basically, this is not uh, what. Actually, uh, forget the grant in it. I'm gonna add uh, npm in it here uh, to create the package.json file here. So here we can uh, add the add our project name like uh, example site so you can also add the version here 1.0.0 and then <coughs> some description here and now uh, we can add entry point of the 
grunt file so we can also add here uh, test command and um, if you have any git repository um, in future i can uh, also uh, make the uh, git tutorials uh, so uh, in future i am gonna add this git repository in the uh, using our current file so uh, for now i'm gonna uh, leave it in pity so my keywords are uh, example and example tutorials so you can also add the author here author and the license yes everything uh, you have uh, uh, written here uh, there is uh, mm, uh, all the details you can see uh, if uh, every detail is correct then uh, you can add yes here now we have created our uh, package.json file so we may also read this or change this uh, description and uh, all those uh, uh, that we have configured uh, so uh, how this is how you can uh, uh, set up your grant uh, with the package.json file uh, and uh, uh, now I'm gonna uh, tell you something about package.json uh, this is uh, 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 once you uh, uh, install any plugin in the in your project di directory it uh, will automatically write down here uh, to uh, re uh, read the code and uh, um, if you uh, can move your project into another uh, computer or another directory uh, so it may also uh, work and uh, uh, keep reminder those plugins uh, with the with using package.json file um, and uh, uh, you can just need to once you move your project in any other uh, um, file directory you may also uh, add just uh, a single command with the uh, npm install command uh, and the, all those plugins uh, that we have that uh, we installed in our project um, that uh, is returned in the package.json file uh, so once you install it and it will automatically uh, read those plugins and install uh, at their own end uh, you don't need to uh, keep remember all those plugins that you have installed uh, for example you have created a complete website uh, and, uh, and you don't need to uh, you don't need to configure uh, for another project you may also uh, copy this and uh, uh, paste to another uh, project directory and uh, just uh, uh, a write command with the npm install it will automatically uh, install your all those plugins so now um, this is all for now and uh, in our next lecture we gonna uh, add some uh, uh, browser sync uh, plugin in our package.json uh, uh, with the npm command so uh, that's all for now i hope you guys enjoy my video and uh, don't forget to subscribe my channel and click the bell icon to getting my videos notification uh, once i upload uh, so uh, uh, and also i have added uh, my uh, social media links and uh, my website link in my description so you can also check this so uh, thank you guys see you in my next video